Hey guys, so I've been traveling in San Francisco for the past week or so, so I wanted to make a video of the five things that I always pack no matter where I go. Hey guys, it's Spencer, your favorite frugal fashionista. So I wanted to make a video of all the things that I pack when I travel, so I'm just going to limit it down to five different things. So I like to pack very minimally when I'm traveling. I always just have one carry-on bag because when you get to their destination, you don't want to have to wait for all these lines of baggage claim and you don't want to happen to lose your bag. So the best way to avoid all those issues and also save money is just using a carry-on bag only. So my first tip and what I always carry with me is a nice pair of black denim. So I got this pair from Primark and it was only $15 and I'm sure you guys have seen it on my Instagram but it's all the time because these are like probably my favorite pair of black denim. But I love wearing black denim whenever I'm traveling because it's so versatile so you can wear it with like a dressier outfit, you can wear it with a casual outfit and it's always a good thing to carry around because you can always pair it with anything that you bring along with it. My second thing that I always bring is a nice black tee. So black tees are obviously a classic thing. So I have this one from Uniqlo, it was only $6. And I love this because if you're feeling lazy, you can wear an all black outfit. And as you guys have probably seen in my previous vlogs, then you know that I love an all black outfit. It's so simple. You pair it with some nice accessories and you get a great outfit. The next piece that I always bring is a nice dressy sweater that you can also dress down. So this one I got from Top Man. It's actually, um, I think it's wool. But it's a nice thin material, so it means that you can layer it through. So this one, um, if you wanted to dress it up, I would probably just wear it with a nice pair of dark denim. Um, and then wear it with some nice boots. And then if you wanted to dress it down, kind of roll up the sleeves. And then you can also just pair it with some light denim um, and some sneakers. And that gets you a really good, nice casual outfit. And so that brings me to my next piece, which is a nice pair of boots. So no matter where I go, I always bring a nice pair of boots because you can always wear this for if you go to a fancy night out or if you are just like in a fall, like colder climate, that's a perfect look for your casual outfits. So I have here a nice pair of Chelsea's that I got from Top Man and I love it because the color, obviously, and also the texture of it. So it's like kind of like a crocodile skin or something. I don't really know, but it's like a really good texture, and so these ones are very flexible, so Chelsea's are on more on the casual side, so if you want to go a little dressier, then maybe go with a wingtip or brogue boot, um, or if you want to go a little bit like middle ground, then I would go with a desert boot, and that would give you a lot of flexibility in terms of what you can bring um, and what you can wear. So you want to basically maximize how many uses you'll get out of each item that you're bringing. And then lastly, I always pack a nice pair of white sneakers. So white sneakers literally go with anything. So they're my favorite piece to bring whenever I'm traveling. And I love these ones because they have a gum sole. So I got these from ASOS. Um, they're about, I think, $12 or $13. Um, they're super cheap, so I've been wearing them for about a year now. Um, and I've worn them to like Japan and stuff, so they're getting a little bit dirty now. Um, but they're definitely true road warriors, and I always bring them wherever I go because you can pair so many different outfits with them. And again, you want to have all that flexibility, allowing you to get different outfits from the same pieces. So that way you minimize how much you're carrying and your carry-on item is gonna have a lot more space in it. And then last, but certainly not least, this is just a side note, because I already gave my five items that I always carry. I always love bringing accessories. So that would just be some necklaces, um, some bracelets that are super flexible that can go with a lot of different outfits. Um, and also some rings, so that way you have some things that just like add a little bit of pizzazz to your outfit. So that's always a good thing to carry around because they don't really add much weight to your baggage and it's super easy to carry around. And I always have this like a go-to set that I always bring with me. So obviously this is not everything that I pack when I go traveling, but this is just like where I start. So when I know that I'm going to go out on a vacation, then I usually just start with these basics and then I add on things looking at the weather. I'm thinking about what other things that I'll need. So if I am going to be going for something that's more casual, more beachy, then I'll bring obviously some swim trunks and stuff like that, or tank tops. Um, but if I'm going somewhere where it's a little more businessy, some more dressed up stuff, I'll layer on more of those button downs and more of boots and uh, dress shoe kinds of things and slacks. So hopefully you guys enjoyed all of these tips. And so these are my five essential pieces that I always bring with me wherever I travel. So let me know in the comments below what was your favorite one, and I'll see you guys next week for your next vlog. Bye!